It's day three and four of our cruise under Norwegian Joy. And honestly, it hasn't been the best experience. They charge for nearly everything. Nothing feels inclusive. They've canceled two shows. And honestly, wait until you see the problem at the pool deck. If you can get through this vlog, my hat goes off to you because I could barely get through the day. Watch and you'll see what I mean. But turning life's lemons into lemonade, we try to enjoy our romantic getaway by heading to La Bistro, a Norwegian specialty restaurant. Well, good morning. Good morning. Guys, we are in Nassau today and it is a very beautiful day. And we have the pool all to ourselves. Check this out, guys. Not a lot of people here. Just kind of hanging out, doing their thing. No line at the water slide. Opens up real soon. Any plans today? Vacation, Let's you know? go. Yeah. Nice, nice. There goes the Disney Wish here hanging out with us at NASA. I like that ship a lot, guys. All right, so we're just chilling, hanging out. Uh, I think we're gonna do some water slides. Hopefully, I can bring the Insta 360 up top, and she doesn't mind. But you know, you know how I be, man. Sometimes I don't want you to have fun, or at least document it. I don't know why crews would do that. It's unsafe. No, it's not. It's fine. What's up, guys? We are at local. The local bar and grill should be pretty good. We're going to do a little bit of bar hopping today. After hanging out by the pool, hung out with Jay for a little bit. You know what? That kid gave us some cool advice. You guys are going to appreciate it. We're just going to take his advice. Appreciate it, Chip. Ship life. But we got some drinks coming. We're going to order these drinks. We're gonna drink these drinks and then have a good time with my wife. Her first y'all. I just got news from Alyssa's mom, from my mom, that baby Noah, she's she's chilling with her, her grandparents this week. Three of them are there taking care of the baby, letting Alyssa get some sleep, some R and R, and check this out. Baby Noah slept from 8 p.m. to 4 a.m. And then she woke up, had a bottle, had a little sippy set of milk, and then uh I had to clarify, right? Because we're at the bar now. And then she slept till seven. She's never slept like that with us at all. Honestly, you know when you're older and you're watching this, that's messed up. <laughs> but I'm happy you're sleeping for grandma. I'm happy you're sleeping for grandma though. But yes, that's messed up. All right guys, this is my drink. It's got like blue curacao, some rum in it, and some whiskey, and a little bit of orange juice. It should be pretty good. You remember what yours was? I'm trying to remember. There's bourbon, ginger, maybe passion fruit. Ah, pretty tasty. Pretty tasty. Yeah, mama likes. Yeah, that's delicious. Probably shouldn't have ordered a fish sandwich with it though. Got the sis, the sis sandwich, guys. <laughs> that that's called the vlogger blooper. All right, let's do this again. The fish sandwich. Yeah, this looks good, guys. Nice and soft, toasty bread. Oh, this has got like a chicken salad sandwich that looks pretty good. It's very good. Yeah? Yeah, this looks good, guys. I'm not going to lie. The best part about this restaurant is that it's complimentary. Yep. All-inclusive. So, That's what it should be like. Mm -hmm. That's what it should be like, Norwegian. Yep. Do that across the entire thing. Blue Bear, what's up? Hi. Uh, we decided to come downstairs and check out some bar menus because we're going to get some drinks before dinner. But we don't have a drink package. So we are going to be strategic about what drinks we have. And I will say that it's totally worth it to get the drink package on Norwegian because the drinks are good and it's really affordable to get the drink package because it's, you know, free, all included. Um, however, if you don't get the drink package, the drinks are actually reasonably priced, which is nice. You know, it's like usually $11, $12 per drink. The whiskey bar is a little bit more expensive, like $13, $14 a drink, but just get the drink package. Yeah. It's worth it. It's worth it. Also looks like there's some sort of like drink tasting that you can do too, like a whiskey tasting. So I'm familiar with that. All right, guys, looks like the mixed bar is closed until about 5.30, so we won't be able to check out anything here. I mean, I guess we can look for the menu, but I don't really yeah. see any of them out. I don't, I don't want to deal with that. So yeah. We'll come back. So, but hey, if you guys need ice, this is where you come get it. Just like to take 
I'm joking, but I'm, we're making a joke that she couldn't find ice earlier, but now. No problems now. No problem all. What's up, everybody? Hello. Hello. I feel like that's all I've said in this vlog. <laughs> Hello. So we <laughs> are going to Le Bistro. We are. Le Bistro. We are. It's um, only 5.18 and our reservations are at 6.30. So we're going to go walk around. Yeah. We'll get a drink at that outside bar or something. Yeah. yeah. It should be fun. Hopefully they let us sit outside. I think they will. Oh, considering there's not a lot of people booking the specialty dining restaurants. That's true. I would like to sit outside and watch the waves go by. I think yeah. And romantic. And very romantic. Wow, wow. Chica, chica, chica. Ah. The bistro. All right, team, we're at the bistro, and I have the steak tartare, and it looks very good. And there's a delicious caper on top. That looks so good. Look at that already bit of piece of it. All right, guys, the duck is here. Can't wait to try it, but I know it's going to be good. It looks delicious. Uh, guys, this is so good, and, and it's done. Like, yeah, this is bomb.com. Buenos dias, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to the show today. And today's show is very stormy. Freaking bad weather. It happens. It just happens to happen on one of the worst Norwegian cruises I've ever been in my life. Just saying. <laughs> All right, so we, I think we're gonna head to local for some lunch, and then uh, we'll see you there. All right, guys, so we are at local again, getting some food because it is a rainy day. Not a lot of things to do, so we're gonna get some food. Got our own little rosé bottle here, and uh, cheers. So what I find interesting is that all the pool chairs on deck with like one tiny pool available to the far right. A lot of people like to hate on Virgin Voyages pool, but it's just the same size, if not smaller, in the right corner of this thing. Like everyone's just kind of facing that one pool. And then there's one person in this like kitty pool over here. It's not, well, it's not a kitty pool, it's, just, it's a pool for everyone. So that's technically the adult only pool. And so there's a lot of adults over there thinking that there's just not, like there won't be any kids over there, but there's legitimately two kids in that pool. Yeah. So why don't you just go over there? Very interesting choice, Norwegian. Look at that, guys. Very interesting choice. So, one kid, two kids playing with the ball, and then you got no one else there, and you got all these pool deck chairs, and one little pool right here for the adults. But please, continue to hate on Virgin Voyages. With a giant screen for everyone to watch of nothing. All right, guys, we just finished watching a few people at the, the go-kart track. <laughs> I'll throw up a clip, but someone ran into a wall, and uh, I'm laughing because they were going full speed, but just, just take a look at this clip. So right now, we are headed, just walking around the ship. Not a lot to do today. It's really, really rainy, so a lot of things get canceled. Not a lot of activities going on. Just a sea day, kind of stuck inside. Go-karts got canceled because it started raining, so they pulled them off the track. One of those days just kind of kind of sucks. But I will, I will give shout out to the Norwegian's movie collection. Incredible. I like it. They have big, big, big choices. Free movies. Free movies. Go Norwegian. Well, you have to pay for some of the movies, but like the actual stations, there's like legit good movies on. And I appreciate that. Yeah. You don't have to pay ten dollars if you absolutely want to watch anything. Yeah. So, we went and checked out the Galaxy Pavilion as well. Man, I'm sure everyone's heard this before, but like $8 a play, that's kind of whack. That's super whack. Well, and it's expensive for a whole pass. Yeah. So, it's like $4.99 for a full week pass, or I guess in this cruise, it's only four days. $4.99. That's true, it doesn't say for how long. It just yeah. says like an unlimited pass. And then the day so pass was like $1.99? It was, I took a picture. Yeah. It was $49 for a day to play in the Galaxy Pavilion. That's a good deal. A good deal. Well, no, it's so expensive. I feel like you just include those things, you know? And then it was, hold on, hold on, hold on. So it was $1.99. It says ultimate speedway package, so $200 if you want to ride the go-karts unlimited for 
for the amount of time that you're here. Yeah. $199 to $200 to play unlimited in the Galaxy Pavilion. But here's here's where you get the deal, hmm. right? Ready for it? Yeah. You can get the ultimate trio package, which is the go-karts, the Galaxy Pavilion, and laser tag for only $3.99 a person. For the cost of an iPad. So um, let me know if you think that's worth it, because I think that's a lot of money. Yeah, I don't know. Just to play games. I, I think it's offensive. I would like, I'd rather wait in line, kind of like that we do the water slides. Yeah. And just kind of wait in line to do your turn on different different things. And it'd be free. And it'd be free. Included. <sighs> Next spot. Listen, I see why cruisers rank this ship 3.3 out of 5 stars. And if I'm being honest, while I'm looking forward to our cruise on the Norwegian Viva, I'll never cruise the Norwegian Joy again. If you want to see how this disastrous trip started, click here. And if you need to see a review, of the Norwegian Joy, click here.